What's up, YouTube? We're back. We started this new little grow here. Uh, everything's pops. It's day three since I knocked these seeds into these uh, rapid rooters here. Right here, I've got the Humber Valley Kush. She popped up first. This one had a heavy seed. Actually, quite a few of them had some heavy seeds attached to them. Little helmets. Uh, I think I might have planted a little bit... Uh, a little too shallow, should have gone a little bit deeper. That's usually uh, the cause of the helmet still being stuck on there. So, anyway, they're all gone now. So, we got the Hummer Valley Kush there, two out of three. This other one's a little lost. She uh, germinated, but hasn't found her way up yet. So, we'll just leave the lid on that. I'll give a little more water this afternoon. Uh,. Right here we've got the LA Confidential. They're all nice and short, no stretch. Here I've got my uh, two tangy lope. Tangy crossed with uh, chocolate. Lope. You can see there's a little bit of seed still left on that one there. These are quite low, but uh, I was worried about stretching a little bit. And I've never worked with an LED before, so I lowered my LED from the three feet down to two feet. And, uh, they seem to be all right. A little bit of the curl. I was keeping the water heavy, and my uh, my humidity did get a little bit low down, about 40. I like to keep it around 50, 55 percent at this stage. You see this little chunk of seed left there. So after the tangy lope here, uh, we've got the Holy Grail Kush, which all but one popped out. This one had a really, really heavy seed on its head. You can still see it split the last of it open. Should open up today or tomorrow. Um, but yeah, the rest of them, they all push those seed shells right out, as you can see. So that was pretty heavy on them. Uh, and this is my only dud out of all the seeds that I have. It's the only girl that didn't germinate. Nothing at all. So, one dud from uh, 12 Holy Grail Kush. Tangy Lope popped nicely. LA Confidential popped nicely. And two out of the three, uh, including this one that had a really heavy shell on it, of the Humber Valley Kush, which I honestly wasn't expecting much from the Humber Valley Kush compared to the DNA. But, uh, yeah, thought it'd be a good time for a quick checkup. Uh, gonna be throwing these into some solo cups today have to bury some of these down a little bit and uh, I'll check back in in a couple days so you have a little bit of uh, vegetation growing on a little bit of leaf growth we'll see you back then